What is up? Uh, uh, this is my main menu. I threw together quickly just with a screen grab. Um, got some buttons. Some of the, the, these don't do much. I think that should quit the game, but if we press that, this should load us into um, what I've done so far with a lot of broken stuff. So I might have to make it again. Uh, trees are a bit wonk, but if we have a look, a uh, uh, closer look at trees, these are, have a dynamic moss, which is a lot. Of, all of this is free, pretty much, other than the zombies. Um, the zombies have got off the store cheap for like five pounds or something but these trees the moss the more they're leaning the moss grows on the upward upper side that's pretty cool um grass obviously i've not finished with the terrain i may even make a new terrain to be fair and the textures i still need work on the tiling's a bit big and meh but the grass kind of hides that mostly anyway but uh fps is a bit poo as well i'm not sure why i'm getting a texture stream in pool error as well um but zombies are there um basic animations they walk slow um, they can see me, should say they can see me top. There we go, he's slowly walking towards me. That one. Um, but no attack yet. Um, we can shoot them though and do damage. A lot of you see this on stream. Four shots and then the death animation and they should despawn to save on performance. Uh, we can always change those settings though. So yeah, a load of zombies, a load of trees. Uh, obviously needs a lot a lot of work i've got a lot to learn but we've got ads which i need to smooth out the transition on that also need to uh have the gun hold still a bit more because when you walk i mean it's realistic i suppose if you was walking like that it'd be like that it wouldn't be dead still would it eh, but it, it would be still other than that oh my kidding oh shit i'm doing a shit job <laughs> obviously very basic implementations at the moment but um there, there's a reload animation kind of throws it off to the side that's reloaded Bottom left, we've got the HUD. Uh, ammo pick up here next to the flag. Just filled our ammo up now. We've got 130 rounds. Cloth simulation on the cloth simulation on the flag, of course. And then we've got some weird terrain stuff going on here with the trees. These should stick to the terrain. This is all procedurally generated. Um, but yeah, sometimes you do have errors. And I think it's because the terrain's messed up because I made mistakes. But I've learned from my mistakes in a future terrain that I will be working on, as you can see. But a bad, bad falcon. <laughs> but if we go up here... Uh, we got the mud texture transition, and it's wet as we come up to the little pond, the lakey pond pond, which of course is our water simulation. Um, I don't have underwater yet, um, floaty for swim swims, but it's all interactable. I can have waterfalls, streams, rivers, whatever. Um, again, problems, but a little dead stump. And then the mountains, and this is all made by hand using the landmass brush. Uh, apparently, after making this, uh, height maps are the best. Uh, if you can, you can make your own and design it, and then create your map from the height map, which will put it in here and make a large area that's kind of all laid out with mountains, your roads, and everything on the height map, canyons, river beds, and things, and then you just paint it and add your assets on top of your height map. But I made this by hand, so I will learn height maps next, how to make my own, or use an existing one and play with it and stuff like that. Of course, we've got rocks dotted about. We got a rock texture on top of the mountains uh this would be like transition to gravel and then into mud and grass and stuff like that and you'd have a lot more assets about but obviously we're just playing at the moment but you can see the rock on the mountains it did look better before i messed it up the landmass brush and the textures you can do uh with the offset it, it looks a lot better it was going from rock to gravel to mud but i i pressed something and turned everything to rock so i've kind of like and i've got these as well so that's something like a, an error with a texture somewhere. And I've got like the uh, the wetness, which is a virtual texture, I think. that, that, that I've deleted it because I, I messed it up. I deleted it, but it's still showing. So it's really weird, little things like that. So I might have to just start again with my terrain. But I've learned so much. Uh, characters obviously fully animated. We've got crouch, aim, sprint, and he lowers his gun. Fire, no um, recoil animation yet, but I have got the animations all there. And we can walk backwards and, and the feet. It's all a bit, it's all a bit wonk, but I'm learning. I'm still learning. And like, like them trees, they shouldn't, they shouldn't all be like that. But that's just where I've messed up the terrain <laughs> big time. Um, if I did a height map and then painted it correctly, the trees would, uh, say for instance, the trees I've set to only grow on grass. So if that was a lot of gravel around the edge of these mountains, I could have the trees not grow there and they wouldn't be on that area, but they'd just be grown on this grass area, the wooded area. FPS seems really shite. It's not a very large map. I suppose there's a lot of grass and trees in this area, so a lot of foliage. 
Hmm. Shadows and light in. We've got some fog uh, going on. But uh, yeah, this is this. Is this. Um, I've set it up so if I could do a build for a, like a test and, and stuff when I learn more, press escape and exits. Um, also, if I... Uh, press play, press quit, it should quit. There you go, that works. But if we press options... Oh, it goes, it goes to an options screen, but I haven't done the options yet, so... Um, I didn't do a back button either or escape to back, back to menu. But that's pretty much how I've got so far. Um, learning Unreal Engine. Um, I probably... I've, I've imported a load of assets that free ones and got a bit excited and, and zealous cyberpunk. Uh, yeah, didn't use a lot. There's my skeleton for my flag and everything. The flag mate. Um, main menu screenshot there. No, it's not. That's my sequencer from my videos and other stuff that I've made. I just used the same project. I should have made a new one to, to create a world proper. Um, but I'm learning, so I can always uh, make a new project and um, try migrating things across maybe that I've worked on or copying like my character and things to carry on working on that in a new terrain project, completely new project, but we'll see. I'm, I'm, I'm still learning, but um, not bad. Press play and, and you're in, there's zombies, there's sound effects, uh, collision, 90 rounds, 140 rounds. Goes down when we fire and we reload and it tops back up and takes from our pool of ammo. Collision should be on on our rocks and trees. Um, yeah, so if I've got run animations in for these, they'll like chase you when they see you, but I've not got all that in. He's kind of like slowly walking to me because he can see me. Uh, somebody else is looking at me and they're not. I'm in their cone of sight, probably him back there. But yeah, he'll slowly walk to me, but not not actually do anything. And I've not got the turn animation, so you'll see him snap around sometimes. Um, but I can, if I learn how, these zombies that, that I purchased from the marketplace do have dismemberment. So I can shoot arms and legs off. And then obviously I'd need to put blood splatters and stuff like that. It's all... I'm using Unreal Zone 3 stuff at the minute for the muzzle flash and basic M4 gun sounds and things like that. No reload sound either, so... Anyway, that's pretty much where I got to now. I have tried building this, uh, or compiling or packaging this build so far. Uh, the plan is to release to people to test for free. Until I learn more and more and more. And obviously it's not going to be uh, no monetary reasons or anything behind anything. It's just me learning. Because um, I've tried before. I've tried before to learn. And I kind of made mistakes and things broke. And then I gave up. And this time I'm, I'm sticking with it. This is way further than I've ever got before. So there's a lot more for me to figure out. But I want to I keep going and actually learn something. I've actually been really passionate about learning. Had a lot of, uh, you know, motivation from a lot of, you know, games that I play and, and people that I watch that make games and things like that on, on Twitch and things. So I thought we'd give it a go. And why not make some kind of zombie game? Very small map, though. Very basic. A lot of problems. But we will iron them out as we go. Let me know if you enjoy uh, game development. And if you play with Unreal or Unity or anything like that. Have any tips? Need to figure out how to optimize, unless my build maybe is better. But I could probably do my options menu and turn down the settings, because currently this is running 1440p and pretty much maxed. With the 4K or 8K textures or something, these are. I've got them scaled right up, because the tiling's weird. But anyway, anyway, I'll stop rambling on. And uh, yeah, just a quick look at what I've been doing, pretty much. I have been doing it on and off on stream as well. Messing with this. On and off, so yeah. If I'm doing a dev stream or some kind of Unreal thingy, this is what I'll be tinkering with and learn more. Put it all together and make a little game for people to mess about with. So, I don't know. Put it on, uh, if I can get a successful build that's working and playable, probably put it on uh, like a Google Drive or something that people did just download. Put it in the Discord and uh, give it a go. And if you find any major issues and say, what the heck is that? Uh, later on down the line, I can take a look. But it's, it's, it's early access ready, though, isn't it, really? I mean, there's worse games on early access. Am I right? I don't know. Probably not. Actually, there's noise there. Oh. Get a proper forest floor in here, though. It'll look nice, won't it? Load of twigs and leaves and stuff and bits of spruce branch all over the floor. River. 
not more. Oh, I've got animals as well. We've got deers running around in here, wolves and stuff. Be pretty cool. Next thing for character and weapons is picking items up, having an inventory screen, dropping items, ammo, not just like normal FPS type picking it up. That doesn't respawn either. I can easily set that to respawn over time. But um, yeah, just to jump in and mess about. That's all it pretty much is. Animations need a bit of a tweak. Got a bit of a snappy snap there on the walk back, but. And the left, right, the gun flicks about. But hey, I could keep going on about issues that I need to solve but and figure out. But uh, two weeks. This is two weeks. Maybe, maybe three. Three maximum of me working in Unreal Engine 4 and learning. Way further than I ever been, have been before. And I catch up and remember everything. But yeah, three weeks, not bad. For three weeks of learning. And not constantly, because I have four kids. So between school runs and when I can stream a little bit and stuff like that, I've been doing this. So not bad. It all... Uh, it all uh, kind of works, so you get the idea. Hey, well, there we go. Let me know in the comments below or in the Discord. And uh, keep us updated. We talk about game dev stuff, or I do anyway, because <laughs> that's what I want to learn at the moment. Got it Got it real, real good. And uh, got the old, the bug, the dev bug. Literally, look at it. Oh, God. Anyway, I love you all, and I'll see you peeps next time.